Hello everyone, it's me Zell, and we're here with another reaction video for Marvel. What if we are watching the fourth episode, which looks like stars Doctor Strange, and um, I'm actually a big fan of Doctor Strange. I wasn't a super invested in the movie when it first came out, um, but obviously as we got to know his character more through the rest of the Avenger films, he became very intriguing and very interesting, and I liked him a lot. So <laughs> this title, he, lose, he lost his hand, heart instead of his hand. Oh man, not sure how that's gonna turn out, but I don't know if it's gonna be good, so. Uh, but anyhow, we're gonna get to that reaction, but real quick, um, for those of you, if you care, I stream on Twitch at twitch.tv dot slash Zell, <laughs> X-E-L-L-L-E. -L -L -E. If you like live content, chatting with other people in the community, there's a lot of crossover folks from YouTube. And I have been playing through, as of recently, Jedi Outcast. Somebody used the point system to ask, request a game, and lo and behold, I'm playing Jedi Outcast and i actually like it it's actually not too bad next i go live we'll probably continue with that playthrough and um yeah it's a lot of fun but otherwise i play other games so anyways if you like to see live gaming content chatting random shenanigans i'm a little bit of a weirdo so hang out with us give a follow there hopefully see you around otherwise um that's enough of that plug we're gonna continue with this reaction and i guess uh we'll see what it's like let's get to it Evening, handsome. This I just pulled it out of the dryer. No, you prepared something. You wouldn't oh. just wing it. It's just me. Okay. Come on, cut the preamble. Oh no. Just get straight to the heart of it. But all I said This is taking a turn. No, 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 Christine. Stephen Strange didn't lose his hands. But his heart. Oh my god. And in the mystic arts. Uh oh. And the ancient one was lost. Stephen Strange stood tall. Dormammu, I've come to bargain. What are you doing? I love him. That's really cool visuals, though. Oh, he's doing something reckless. Something wrong? I, uh. Oh, let me hear it. Come on. I know you prepared an acceptable oh, no. for today. <laughs> what? I don't know. Maybe, You're... maybe you make me happy. <gasps> Still got me. Evening, handsome. Oh, we missed our turn. It's okay. We'll be fine. Pizza and creme brulee. Oh no, I am not getting grease on this dress. <sighs> no. Wow, they're really. I guess you can't change. You're the only thing that matters. And he's put himself through that over and over and over again. Can't really talk, it's so sad. At least he didn't turn into a villain. Help me bring her back. Her death is an absolute point in time. I'm creating a paradox. You cannot reverse an absolute point. I only require more power. The greatest uh -oh. sorcerers I will be forced to stop you. You'd have to find me first. Oh, excuse me. Where are you going? This intro episode is very intriguing. I don't I don't have a lot to say because I'm just like mesmerized by it. Anyone home? Wow. This leads you down a path considered to be unnatural. You have to be the strangest dress sorcerer I've ever seen. Where can I find Cagliostro? There. Maybe nowhere. Mm. Is that him? Your name's Obang. Librarian for the books of Cagliostro. Okay. Go, this way. <laughs> oh. The lost books. Aha. Gain the power through the absorption of other beings. Other beings? Absorption. Are you 
What path you taking, Strange? This is almost so kind of giving me uh, Full Metal Alchemist vibes. Uh oh. Wait a second. Is that the same creature that got harder? There is a fine line between devotion and delusion. Love can break more than your heart can shatter your mind. Wow, this guy is has some good lines. Uh -huh. If they won't surrender their power, I'll take it. Okay. Let's start small. Oh no! No! Strange. This is feeling very Sith. Alright, what's next? I'm thinking Sotor absorbing nice Sith powers. Ugh. But I draw the line of bugs. I know you're being cutesy and humorous, but you're also killing. More. Oh no. Okay, strange. He's losing it. These creatures are really cool. I could warn him, intervene. But the fate of his universe is not worth risking the safety of all others. Hello? Oh, strange communicating with the Watcher. So what, they just cease to exist? So if he dies, they are all dead. Time to meet an old friend. Hello again, and goodbye. Oh my gosh. Watch the bug defeat him. <laughs> How long have you been there? Put that oil's magic to remain frozen for centuries. I chose to live. Death is part of the plan. I can't accept that. <laughs> Maybe the other Strange will. <gasps> other? He wasn't even the only Doctor Strange in this universe. Really? Oh, oh good. Um, you're right. Enough living in the past oh. for one evening. Oh my gosh. What the heck? What was in that whiskey? No, whoa, wait a minute. There's so much remnant yes. Star Wars so in this. this must be I drew upon the power of the dark dimension to split the timeline. I'm looking whoa. for the lost library. Enough living in the past for one year. Yeah, that's the simplest whoa. or smartest thing to do. Heavy duty protection spell. Knowing me, I'll need it. Wow. How would you find it? That's a great. Nope, it's not. I like how calm they are about this. When are you? Oh my. Do not be frightened. They never knew her. We knew her. We loved her. You can't bring her back. I am you. Oh, seems like it's a bit much for you, bud. And now can you save her? Not without we you. Can. He's not trying to absorb. Deranged. I will be whole again. Your marbles are long gone. <laughs> the world. He is quite cool looking. I gone too far. He does he not understand that if the world ceased to exist. Christine still does. Oh no! Cloak versus cloak. Save him. Oh, he did! No! What? Uh oh. Oh, that was the Watcher. <gasps> we can be together again. You're not her. No, all of his runes. My gosh, the gem is Christine. Christine. It's me, Christine. <laughs> I I brought you back. I saved you. No, this is this is oh, this is a nightmare. Stop it! Same way you fixed Christine. 
I was wrong. I You were I, warned. The world shouldn't pay for my arrogance. You're a god. You can undo this. I'm not a god, and neither are you. But I can't interfere. Meddling with time and events only leads to more destruction. No. No! Uh. I'm sorry. One life, one choice, one moment can destroy the entire universe. Dude, what the heck? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> That's why they don't write movies like that. <laughs> Not even Doctor Strange could defeat his other destructive self so of course he wasn't gonna win he tried to convince him but he was more powerful he wasn't gonna beat that and i mean the watcher's not wrong he's like i can't interfere and then he was alone in his own prison nothing changed like he couldn't even see logic he couldn't even see that the world will die but christine will be alive well christine can't live in a world that ceases to exist and I'm assuming they showed the gem had changed somehow. He couldn't even go back in time to just forget all this. Well, I mean, I didn't have a lot to say during the episode because it was kind of depressing. It's always hard to say like, oh, I liked it when it was so sad, but I did. It was really good. It was really beautifully voice acted and animation was phenomenal. Like Doctor Strange does very well in animation. <laughs> you know, there's a lot of very um, heavy concepts in the Doctor Strange with reality, with timelines, kind of like Loki, right? It's hard for us to kind of track when there's basically infinite possibilities. Like we like to have some sort of pattern to follow and some with these, with chaos, it's not really. And that's essentially what he absorbed all mystical beings in the universe, essentially what it seemed like. He was living for centuries to do all this. Uh, reality was passing him by. I mean, yeah, uh, I think this was really good. <laughs> as, uh, as depressing as it was, and I guess I didn't expect it to end like this, but I guess I should have because this is what if, and they're like, what if these are possibilities that could and may happen in other timelines where it's not a happy ending. So, and I think it's a really interesting message about death. And I think I really like the, the librarian the guy who was watching over um, the library and he had a lot of wisdom. He like he said, I learned these lessons from life, not from books. Because it's it's true. Like there are certain experiences. We've all been that where our parents will tell us these lessons. And they're like, don't do this. And sometimes people will, oftentimes actually, people will still experience it for themselves because it's really hard to really get it unless you've ex lived that experience. Um, you can always sympathize, um, empathize, uh, but a lived experience is something that can truly gain. Not that I'm suggesting we all burn our hand on the stove, like ease early childhood lesson example but yeah so he tried to convince him and pass on his wisdom best he could he's like i've accepted death it's part of life and part of the path and and unfortunate it's kind of a little sad that christine wasn't able to have that she was brought back from her death and then had to re-experience it a ceased to exist uh no an alt no longer reality so anyways we can go on and on overall i, I thought the episode was again beautiful overall the voice acting the animation the music of course very somber the fight scenes very good um dr strange is a very fascinating character um and i love the librarian character and with his messages a lot of interesting points covered so yeah with that said i hope you guys enjoyed it too um as a reaction commentary goes for this episode um thanks marvel what if what if the world ended because dr strange lost his heart and he got obsessed with trying to bring it back to life who else had travesty struck and again ends up killing star wars there's a lot of little similarities i was finding with like the whole dark side consuming you because you want to bring back the one you care about which i'm sure is a repeating theme in a lot of things but 
just thought I should say that. I definitely saw that. Anyways, thanks so much guys for watching. If you want to see more, I recommend hitting that subscribe button. Make sure you have the notification bell. Sometimes we're not super consistent when we get the videos out, uh, but that's a good way to be notified. Also, like the video if you enjoyed this one. That shows me you enjoyed it and helps support the channel. Again, if you want to check out some live content, follow over on Twitch. Um, anyhow, thanks so much, guys. Hope you are well, and I will see you on the next episode.